Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Motion Pretty Guys, another video guys. Welcome back to the channel. I am trying out a brand new webcam. This webcam's cool because look, I, it's it's a DSLR. So like the zooming and zooming out and stuff, I could do it personally on the camera, which is kind of far from me, but it's okay because we got a fisheye lens so you guys can see the whole bedroom, the whole setup and stuff like that. My beast PC right here, which I can change the wallpaper, but we're not here to talk about any of that stuff. If you guys do want like a bedroom tour to see what I got going on in my room, let me know down in the comments section below. I think I might move my Christmas tree like over there or something. So that way you guys can actually see it on the webcam because I, I am a little festive in my room with a Christmas tree. But you guys can't see it just because it's out of the frame. But with, with that being said, let's forget all that stuff. Guys, season seven in Fortnite is coming very, very soon. And I'm super excited for it. I don't know about you guys. I haven't actually played Fortnite in a while. But this long break from Fortnite actually made me miss Fortnite. It made me actually enjoy the game. Because sometimes when you're grinding something out so much and you're doing it consistently, it gets boring, it gets tiring, and you're just like, you know, I don't want to do this no more. It's just I'm, I'm bored of it. So it's sometimes it's nice to take a break, stop doing it for a few weeks, maybe three weeks, a month maybe. That's how long it took me to take a break from it. And then you come back and you miss it, you enjoy it, you like it again. So again, like I said, that's just part of life. Like you can't, you can't constantly pump something in your head or constantly be doing something. You got to miss it to enjoy it. You know, you got to miss it to appreciate it and enjoy it. So that's basically what I did. I took a break, you guys, and I did that. But we're going to talk about Season 7. So there was a fan-created trailer to Season 7. And this this trailer is amazing. Like, guys, I, I'm not going to lie to you. This, this trailer is freaking awesome. We're going to play it right now. And I'm going to give you guys my live reaction to it. But this thing is sexy. So it's playing right now. So it's on Reddit, uh, Fortnite BR. Um, and as you guys can see, this is what? The... the the final skin that you can unlock, which is the robot skin. I don't know exactly what it's called. And it looks real. Like, this... The robots start running down the hill. Everything looks real. It looks like something Fortnite would do. Especially with this coming up here in a second. That right there. The portal or whatever. It looks just like something Fortnite would do. The two skins in the game that just recently got released are trying to make something. And then all of a sudden... It starts snowing, and we do know that snow is coming to Fortnite Battle Royale. The, the robots and stuff that are, I guess, evil, I guess they shut down because of the snow. I don't know why they would, but it is rumored that Season 7 is all based around winter, snow, stuff like that. So if you guys don't know, we're going to be dealing with snow. We're going to be dealing with stuff like that. If you guys know, on Spawn Island, it's already snowing way back before it started snowing on Spawn Island. We saw something in the distance on the map, which it started to uh, actually... We saw like an iceberg or something like that. And it started getting bigger and bigger over the time. So we do know that the map is going to be filled with snow. Which I definitely love. I wish they did this last Christmas. But last Christmas all they did was add Christmas lights to the bushes. Which was not really anything special. Now that we're going to see snow. This is going to feel like a brand new map. We're going to see a different type of texture to the map. Everything is going to look amazing and stuff like that. But we have some leaked skins. If you guys want to know what skins are coming out. In Season 7 Battle Pass, we actually have the leaked skins right here. Let me bring it up on screen right now, you guys. So as you guys can see, this is it right here. Actually, this is not it. This is my Twitter. So if we go to Fortnite Battle I saw it on Instagram first, and then I decided to check Twitter because Twitter always has it. Uh, I think it's right here. Okay, so a number of Season 7 Battle Pass skins have been leaked. I hope you guys can see this. I hope it's big enough. Um, but yeah, so if we click on this right here, we can actually see some Season 7 skins may have been leaked. So let's go back here um, and let's go to the leaked images that Fortnite is, I guess, tweeting out to us. So as you guys know, one of the images is this one right here. I'm trying to find the actual image. We'll just click on this link and it'll, it'll end up showing us the actual image. So this is one of the images that Fortnite ended up actually leaking out to us. If you guys don't know, this one right here. So this is basically, it, it, it's Fortnite Season 7. As you can see, there's a guy right here and then a, uh, I guess, a cat woman snowboarding down. People zoomed into it and they were able to find that this is basically it. This is the cat woman right here that everyone's talking about. And then this is the main guy. This is the last guy that we're going to be able to unlock. This guy right here, if you guys look, the blue eyes, blue eyes, the, the four what spikes coming out of his head the four spikes coming out of his head so this is the main guy that we're going to unlock this is one of the skins you guys um and then i guess this one is another one now they only leaked this much of it but let's read on to this so season seven is set to begin tomorrow december 6th but the ios store may have revealed some of the outfits early with the new screenshots circulating on twitter these outfits will be part of the battle pass but their tiers are unknown epic tends to show off tier one skins in the center of the promotion material okay so they they're saying that this is going to be 
Okay, so what I'm thinking is Epic does like to show off the main skin, the first skin from Tier 1 as the first skin. So this is probably going to be like the fully upgraded version if you, you know how we can now upgrade our skins. Like you can unlock the werewolf guy, but he doesn't turn into a werewolf until you actually gain XP within the game. So this is probably like the final form of one of the guys that we're going to unlock. But it's probably going to be just a normal like human or something like that. And then we end up unlocking different armors on him and stuff like that. That's probably going to be one of the things this cat woman's going to be another skin this viking looking i don't even know what you guys want to call him he's going to be another skin in the game well this isn't confirmed and shouldn't uh be taken as facts the character in the middle on the left seems to resemble the ones in the teaser so far guys i'm sorry if i can't read um yeah so basically this is the cat woman that's snowboarding down the hill we see that girl right here so they fortnite tweeted it out and they zoomed in and then there's this guy right here grappling on to the cat woman that we could barely see so if we go to fortnite we can actually see that let me let me go back if we go back here and then you zoom in let me see where we can find it i just saw it somewhere up okay so right here this is the guy grappling hooking onto the girl so i guess he's apparently there's gonna be there's an airplane what i just noticed this there is an airplane in the yo this is gonna be crazy so okay so there's a, a werewolf claw looking guy i don't know what you want to call him but he's got like bear claws on his feet and in on his hands and he's using a gra a grappling hook so basically it's like a zip line you hook it to one side of the mountain you hook it to the other side of the mountain and you zip line across the mountain which is going to be cool i do hope they bring that to the game and it looks like you're going to be able to shoot as you're zip lining through the mountain so it's not like you can only zip line because this guy's holding his gun out um and these are just little things you got to pay attention to and then in the back we see an airplane are they bringing airplanes to the game? They did bring vehicles, if you guys don't remember, the golf cart, the shopping cart, and then the uh, ATK, and now they have an airplane. So are they bringing airplanes to the game? If they do, first of all, I don't think the Fortnite map is big enough for airplanes. If these airplanes have guns on them, it's going to be a wrap. The game's not going to be that much fun. But I just wanted to bring you guys this video because I wanted to update you guys, knowing that the it's coming out tomorrow basically i want you guys to be prepared and know what is coming tomorrow so if it's worth it let me know down in the comment section below if you guys please can give this video a thumbs up if we could break like 100 likes on the video i will be giving out free battle passes to you guys so every 100 likes or something like that i will pick one winner down in the comment section below so every 100 likes i'll pick a winner so if we get like a thousand likes that's 10 people on buying battle pass that's a hundred dollars holy crap i should have thought about this but I got you guys, so just comment down below. Let me know that you guys want the battle pass, what system you play on, and what your epic name is, and stuff like that. And then say Season 7 Hype. Guys, with that being said, I'm ending the video. My, my battery light is flashing. I gotta end it. I, I'm trying out this new camera. I hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in Season 7. Peace.